everyone welcome to the very last video of the color series it has been a whirlwind if you want to binge watch or re-watch the entire color series i do have a playlist called color series so make sure you watch that it has been a fun run um i was able to a save a lot of money with recycling old things that have been on my channel um and b figure out what stuff i actually have because i didn't even know i had half of the stuff and see, be able to downsize. My Depop and Nidus' Depop is linked in the description box below. Today it's all about like rainbow and um, like body stocking stuff, like OS kind of thing, but more like rainbow and like funky vibes. So if that is something that is of interest to you, please keep watching. Frost, you have not bothered me this entire time I've been filming. Why now when I only have like one video left? <laughs> Why must you do this to me? It is December, even though I'm filming this on October the 2nd. Um, but we needed to get a lot of things done because there's a lot of things going on in my life right now. So in December, what should be happening? Uh, we should be moving right now. Um, we just got back from a trip to Japan, which hopefully was pretty awesome. And I didn't get sick. That would be great um, because I'm really weird with like foods and stuff like that. And uh, hopefully the 11 hour flight from California to somewhere in Japan I don't even know where we were and I just like did a lot of it was good too anyways let's get right into it it is that time we are looking at dossier so today we have no no fight no fight today we just have one it is a spicy vanilla I'm not gonna lie to you I stole this from Nidus um it is inspired by Tom Ford Noir Frost you just have to wait buddy bear um, so yeah, I, this ended up in my stash somehow and I don't know why, but it's been featured on her channel before and mm, it smells so good. Oh, I love it. It's definitely a more masculine scent, but it's like a good masculine scent. It's not like an overpower or like overbearing masculine scent. They do have feminine masculine and they do have a new genderless co collection, which is not inspired by any fragrances. It's just like Dosie's own fragrances, which I think is really cool. Uh, they also have reed diffusers as well as candles. Uh, make sure you take that fragrance quiz. I'll make sure to link that in the description box below. And if you sign up for the emails, you do get a discount code as well. And I'm sure they'll be running deals for Christmas. Uh, these make really good stocking stuffers they come in a pretty small box that is 100% made out of recyclable material and is recyclable itself um so yeah it makes a good little Christmas gift and you know what if you decide to gift someone fragrance and they don't like that fragrance that is okay they have a money back guarantee all the information can be found on their website the link to the description box below thank you so much and let's get into the video all right we are back this is the first outfit this is from oh yeah queen lingerie i do just have pasties and undies over or underneath it because it is completely see-through i like it i think it'll be a good addition to some form of set i don't like i don't know maybe i'm thinking i'm thinking i'm doing like a rainbow dash cosplay but i actually have an idea with two other pieces that are in here so i'll show you this but this definitely has like we can do some vibes with this. I, I I really like this one. It is OS, it's one size. It is insanely stretchy, so it could fit small, medium, large, extra large, probably like XXL, I would say. OS is decently size inclusive, but once it gets to like plus sizes, it's kind of like you're lying. It's not one size. Um, so not one size fits all, but one size fits most. So what do we think about this one? And let's get into the next item. So this is the next item. I do have pasties on, but I don't know. I'm just like a little worried, I guess. Um, but it is a bodysuit with like thigh high stockings. Um, you can literally see the pasty YouTube, so don't yell at me. Anyways, here is the back. It's just a plain blue bodysuit. I've had this for literally ever. Um, the shoulders slip off all the time it's kind of annoying i use this for a pokemon set way back in the day um i'm probably gonna keep it just because of the nostalgia because i've had it for forever um it is a really pretty turquoise blue and yeah that is that's this outfit this is the next outfit um it is not like a rainbow but it is neon yellow and it is a like a body suit or not body suit but like considered in the body stocking realm uh, it was from Timu. It's like in the tiniest little bag ever. Like it literally looks so small, um, but it works and it works for this video. So um, I probably won't purchase off of Timu again. I know they're in like the middle of like a lawsuit and like all that stuff, but 
Um, this was in my stash, so let me know if you think I should keep this or not, and let's get into the next outfit. This did come in like a bunch of other sizes too, and this was only like a couple bucks. I think it was like three dollars, but um, yeah, I uh, I think I might even have this in pink. I don't know, maybe it might be in my stash. It might be right here on the floor. We will see. That's the next thing I'm trying on, so we'll see if it's the same. Okay, so this is the next outfit. Obviously, it is not the same. It is a two-piece. It is a skirt with a crop top. There is a lot of room. <laughs> it is definitely one size fits most. And yeah, once again, this was from Timu as well. It came in like the tiniest little bag. Was a couple bucks. Uh, decent quality. Glows in the black light. I bought it to use as a base um, for some fun neon shoot. And yeah, what do we, what do we think about this one? All right, and then this is the last item in the kind of color rainbow smorgasbord color series. This concludes the color series. This is from Shin. Um, I do plan on putting this on Depop. It's just not, I don't know, the model made it look so amazing, but I don't think it looks amazing on me. I don't know. If you like it, let me know. Maybe I'll keep it. It is a one piece. It's pretty easy to get into, actually. Uh, pretty full coverage bottom, so could where I don't know I feel like I'd be comfortable on a family beach with this but it's definitely gonna be really really odd tan lines so that's why I was like ah I don't know but let me know in the comments below and I really really hope you enjoyed this color series I know this was a shorter video but it was just kind of like the random smorgasbord of stuff last that I had in the bin uh next week goes back to regular programming I have a huge metallic micro bikini haul to do uh and then an amazon wishlist thing and um yeah so that's that i hope you enjoyed this color series um i don't plan on doing it again on this channel uh just because i've gone through like everything now um and yeah but i hope you enjoyed if you're interested in more color series things uh Nias also did uh some color series um stuff in between things that she's doing i think she's done blue white and like red and maybe black because she's also downsizing and yeah don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I will see you next week. Thank you so much for watching and happy December.